All right. Well, let's let's take the new, the last guy on this list, the Joku here, maybe the forgotten man in this Corey Coleman trade away. I don't know how much it. He's already a pretty high draft pick in general. Oh, it's outrageous for uh, Joku. Does, does this? Do you like this anymore? Do you like this any less? Does it do anything for, for Joku? We just we're giving Gronk a ton of love because of a bunch of things just happened over there. But Gronk's Gronk. Um, yeah. Well, I mean, without knowing anything about the. Uh, you know, Clearly, Najoku's a metric freak stud, uh, well, Sashi Brown draft pick. Uh, I think, I mean, uh, who do, if you don't like the idea of Njoku... I have no you, problem with Njoku. Who, who doesn't not, like Njoku? I wasn't, saying that, I, wasn't saying that already. Slight, I wasn't saying that to slight him. Sure. No, I mean, I'm. we're all we're all as high as you almost can be on Joku, but, but I'm not on that ADP none of us, high. None of us ever get him because right. people are just way higher on him. Right. But it could pan out for you. I mean... Baker Mayfield loves the slot, loves, loves the middle of the field, loves the seam. His tight end did work in college. For sure. Tyrod Taylor's tight end has always done solid work. Right. Charles Clay led the team in targets, I think. Yeah. So it could it, happen. We a, just don't a, have anything to go off of. It's a matter of if Joku's actually going to be that guy or if he's just the metric freak. I mean, he did score four touchdowns well, on all, 32 receptions. All but, great points right there, Jay Wayne, about all that stuff. And the, the we, what we do have to go all and most of those touchdowns were like really good looking plays. Oh yeah, yeah he's a the, freak. Joku, there's flashed, no doubt about there's it. There's no the doubt granite about gazelle, it. Gazelle, as yeah. we called him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not so, the Impala, the Gazelle. Did, we go, did he end up being the Impala? I, I, I think uh, I think uh, Ingram was the was the Impala. Okay, because he's faster. Right. Okay. Either top speed. Either way, <laughs> just. Dude flashes and he jumps off jumps off the screen when he when he gets a ball, when he gets an opportunity. That's it's just the opportunity. How many targets is he really going to have? I mean, if you have a if you have an ability to put him on your team and feel good about him being a guy that's just going to sit on your bench, that's one thing. You know, that's my that's my whole thing. But that's about not this. where you're drafting him right now. I know, but that's what I'm like. That's my whole thing. Like if you if you have. I don't. If you have just this infatuation with him, you can get around. Put him. You can get around overpaying for anybody. I just the 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 amount of equity that you have to spend to put him on your team is is up there for the, the near term return for your starting lineup is just not there. For some for some flashy plays that have looked good, the raw athleticism that looks good, but really a lot of unprovenness for him to be, you know, kind of where. Oh he yeah. Is. Well, that's the thing. We've seen a lot of raw flashy you right. know very athletic tight ends come in and not do anything for your team forever yeah like we've seen that time and time and time again and the evan ingrams don't i got grow. much more of a problem with where evan ingram is the, than the, the joker the evan ingrams don't grow on trees i, I, I like evan ingram i mean at least fine. you saw him crush sure, you for saw a him, year. you saw him get a lot of targets and catch them i'm i'm fine with that but you know i just he, he's up he's a pick behind Ertz. like that's yeah crazy to me yeah i mean i don't i don't if I, I mean I, I we were in a we're in that super flexible flexible friends league and it's a it's just lower money league and so we always trying to have some fun during that draft and I was it was an auction draft which was awesome and I was bidding a lot of money on Joku because it's like a two tight end league you have to start two tight ends which is a, is a crazy rule but whatever and I was like fun. let me get some in Joku because I really want some Njoku. Because you're have not going to necessarily pay up for him anywhere else, and you're trying to you're, right. you're having fun. Right. So I was going back and forth with this one guy, and we were just dollaring each other, and he would go five more dollars, and I'd go a dollar, and he's DMing me, man, why are you going one more dollar? Why don't you go five? I'm like, why don't, Why are you going more than one? I don't get it. Whatever. So I'm. we get up there, and I'm fine. He's like, all right, you, you can have him. Like, I, we went way too high. Spent. I don't even – I can't think of the ratio right now, but it was just – and then, like, Five hours later, someone comes over the top of me for five more dollars, and I was just like, like someone that wasn't even in this bidding war, and I was like, "Geez, all right, enough." <laughs> I like this is a cheap league, and I still can't even pay up for this People guy. People love like, him; it's crazy, People but it could him. pay off for him. Like, oh, I'm, I'm not doubting it. I'm not doubting Evan Ingram could pay off for you. He was fine for you last year, and I'm not doubting that the Joku could pay off for you. And I just the price that you're paying for well, really you an don't unproven know. track right. record. Evan Ingham already paid off for you. I mean, that you you couldn't have paid enough for him last year. What it doesn't matter where you bought him, you didn't pay enough for him already. What I, what you're saying now, he's a pick behind Ertz. That's one thing. I mean, Evan Ingram was in the 80s and 90s last right. year as a rookie. Like it, he he already crushed it. He already paid you. He was at um, sitting here in a, just in the 90s until September. I got him right. at two four in a 12 man with absolutely draft. nothing going on in New York. It's true, but it could get a little easier. More mouths, but yeah, but open, the whole thing more open was field. the volume. Yeah, but he did. He produced. That's he all did. He did. But I mean, say, what way. I'm saying, like, no, what was there? 
Nothing. And, to, and now it's way up at sure, but he was still Ertz. a twenty-two-year-old rookie sure. tight end doing sure. things that nobody's ever done before. But we're still talking about a guy who's a pick behind Ertz, right? That's the, that's and the deal Odell's coming here. back and Saquon's in there and all that good but stuff. But no McAdoo. <laughs> Anything could happen as long as McAdoo's <laughs> not around. The sky's the limit over there yeah. in New York. There's just no chance so I'm taking tender. So a 22-year-old. Well, that's, I mean, but he's, 20, he's a tight 20. end at pick 44. I, I understand what you're saying, but you, you got you're, you're, you could take plenty of tight ends after him that may or may not ever be as good as he is. Yeah, but I could take Jared Cook in the 15th round. Yeah, but I, I would still be rather, I'd rather put in. You would rather room. spend your fourth round pick on a guy who may or may not be good? I I've mean, never, ever once even seen you consider Evan Ingram on any team, ever. Well, it's only half a year to worry about this, but yeah, I mean, after what he did, I'm considering him. Mm, I'm heard definitely it. not trading him. Well, no, I mean, in a in a tight end premium format where well, you get 1.5. Well, that's not even the DLF format that we're talking about right here. Mm. Yeah, I don't think he moves up too much over that anyway. That's what I'm... And, and premium with the target volume, you know, I can... I can justify it a little bit more, but not, not just a regular dynasty league. Like that's insane. All right. Well, does that wrap up the Browns? Let's let's put a ribbon on that. Yeah. Well, that was the Giants, but <laughs> I know. But I know that's how we do. 